about my congregation, Society of African Missions. I'm also going to talk about the missionary sisters of Our Lady of Apostles, O Ellie. So Father is here for two purposes, for the SME and for the OLA. I wouldn't say anything about our founder. I'm only going straight to the congregation. The SMA, as we might have heard about or of, is Society of African Missions. Someone might be asking, why not SAM, S-A-M, and S-M-A? It's a congregation with a Latin name, Societas Missionum Art Afros, S-M-A. Founded on the 8th of December, 1856, in Lyon, France, by the servant of God, Bishop Melchior de Marion Bresiac. Society of African Mission, as the name already explains, is a society founded for Africa and people of African origin in the world. So meaning we work in Africa and any other part of Africa or any part, other part of the world where we have Africans. The first missionaries of SME arrived on the shores of Gold Coast on the 18th of May, 1880. They arrived on the shores of Gold Coast, specifically Elmina. And these two missionaries were Auguste Moreau and Eugene Murat. So they used Elmina as the center of the mission before going to what? The interior and the other parts of what? Uh, Ghana, especially the southern ecclesiastical province. You know, those days we will say, the mission of Ghana was divided into two, the Southern Ecclesiastical Province and the Northern Ecclesiastical Province. So the Southern part of Ghana was evangelized by the SMA. My dear brothers and my dear sisters, you know, talking about the mission in Ghana, you can't write off the SMEs. Talking about evangelization of Ghana, we have to First of all, think about who? The SMAs. So they were those who have established the church in what? In Gokos, especially. We are talking about Ghana. And when they arrived in 1880 to evangelize, they realized that there was also a need for what? Social interventions. That is taking care of the sick taking care of those who also want to study, especially the girl-child education. So that was where they invited the OLA sisters. So the OLA sisters, or the congregation was founded in 1876 by the first superior general of the SMA, Father Augustine Planck. And the first sisters arrived in Ghana in 1883, three years after the arrival of the fathers. And when they arrived in Ghana, they took care of a lot of social uh, concerns, the sick, teaching also. It was from there that the first school was established in Gokos, talking about uh, the current Ola Training College. What is the charism of the SMEs and the OLEs? Talking about the charism, the SMS charism is first of all missionary oriented towards who? The Africans and those of African origin. That is why we work in 16 countries in Africa, including Ghana, as well as we work in Europe, we work also in Asia, we work also in America. And now we have about 26 SMA Ghanaian priests. When SMA came into Ghana, someone might ask, why is it that SMA was the first to arrive in Ghana? And we are only talking about 26 members. SMA's motive was what? The foundation and the strengthening of what? The local church. When we came, our purpose was to establish the local church and make it strong. That is why from the origin, 
the SMAs were not taking blacks. We were rather at, they are advising the blacks to join what, the local church. But now we realize there is the need for blacks also to evangelize. People came to evangelize our country. We also have to be missionaries in order to evangelize. Now the church has been talking about re-evangelization and new evangelization, meaning we all have to be involved in what the missionary work. So my dear brothers, my dear sisters, who might be interested in the SMA and the OLA, uh, Father is around. If you have any other question, I wouldn't want to spend much time. Any other question, you can meet Father after the session, and Father will, will explain more to you. Thank you very much.